an auction house charges a commission of 15% on the first $50,000 of the sale price of an item, plus 10% on the amount of the sale price in excess of $50,000. What was the sale price of a painting for which the auction house charged a total commission of $24,000? Uh, so let's just find a generic equation to start. Uh, we got our total commission. And that is equal to 15% uh, of the first $50,000. And then we got to add to that 10% uh, and everything else on uh, the part greater than $50,000. Uh, so let's think. Uh, how would we find this if uh, if a uh, if a piece of uh, art sold for uh, fifty five thousand dollars? That would mean uh, the first fifty thousand dollars I would take fifteen percent of, uh, and then I would take ten percent of the remaining uh, uh, price, which is five thousand dollars. So in other words, this number here uh, we can think of as. being just $50,000 uh, minus the uh, total, I should say the total price minus $50,000. So 0.15, so assuming uh, that uh, our, uh, uh, our, our price was over $50,000 and so we use all of this commission here and based on our answer choices, all of them are over $50,000, this is, you're gonna, would use that whole thing uh, plus 0.1 and I don't want this inequality here because uh, I can't really do algebra with that so I want this to be uh, my price of my painting minus $50,000 and so this here represents the excess over $50,000 so now let's start filling in what do we know uh, my total commission is $24,000 My price here is what I'm solving for, and so I should be able to do that uh, with what I have here. So what is 15% uh, of 50,000? Uh, 15 times five is 75, so 15 times 50,000 would be 75, 750,000. Uh, so 15% uh, of 50,000 would be 7,500. So 7,500 plus uh, 0.1p, uh, so that's what we're calling for, minus, uh, so 10% of 50,000 should just be 5,000. So what do we have now? 24,000 equals 7,500 minus 5,000 is 2,500 plus 0.1p. Uh, 24,000 minus 2,500 is what? Uh, 24,000 minus 2,000 is 22,000, so 21,500 is equal to, and so 0 0.1, remember, is what, one-tenth times P. So to find T P here, I could multiply each side by 10 to get rid of that one-tenth. Uh, and we get uh, P is equal to 21,500 with an extra zero at the end. 215,000. C.